Hi, I'm Sydney Long, and I'm here with Norby Mazora, who is the MC of today's Vex Robotics Tournament. So, Norby, what do you find to expect from this event? Well, um, I just, oh, you got two, you got one. All right, um, what's going on here is that there's a whole bunch of robots that are going to do some stuff, and I have to say what they're doing. That's about it. Well, that's a very interesting job. Uh, Can we hug? Hi guys, I'm here today with Cuba Eris Manuel Mazora Guevara. Well, Cuba, what can you tell us about your events? I'm going to borrow the mic. Alright, so it's a great event. Let's let's pan to the to the right please, camera. You can see a, you know, a good amount of people right here. Uh, we're getting ready for this event. It's going to turn out great. Pan back to me please. We got Sydney here reporting. It's not live. No. Uh, we got. It's, it's previously recorded. What's, here we have my brother reporting, emceeing. So we're we're gonna have a blast. We're gonna have a real good blast with this. PJ, get in the shot, man. Just just get in here. Come yeah. on. Just get it in. You know, most people don't see the actual camera, man. Yeah. This is PJ. That's PJ. <laughs> the cameraman's behind the camera. Austin. But... Austin is also the cameraman. Okay. There's two multiples. Here we have Miss Bell. Coming off. She's coming right in. Miss Wilson making everything happen. We thank her for this. Yes, we do. Wait, let's turn this interview around. So, what do you think is going to happen today? Oh, happen? man. Uh, well, a lot of these kids seem advanced in robotic technology. I I would expect maybe a, possibly a transformer, maybe a iRobot type robot right. to, Very possible. Scene, to meet the scene. Maybe even just an eco drive hybrid car. That, that's a little too far, but we could do it. But yeah, we'll we'll see what we get. I don't know. Uh, we'll work on that. We'll work on that. Yeah. All right. So we got this guy walking around with tape. I don't know what's going on. Hey, who so. is this guy? Well, this is gonna be a tough one to score. Yeah, definitely. I'll give you some time for this one. That's a match. We're going to start. Driver control and this is last pitch. Three, two, one, go. It's a nice Go 
It's good? Yeah, Alright man, since we're happening man. 4033, you ready to see them? Let's go man, let's get it. Alright, so let's have it. We're picking up the sacks. Yep, we're getting Cray up in here. Oh, we're putting it up. Bam! Look at those skittles. Get the ones against the glass, man. Let's go. He's going to the other side, man. He's picking them. He's giving them an advantage right there. We out here. All right, man. Wait, wait, wait. A minute and 16 left. Man, this is really getting intense right here. It's two against one. But I think we can really do this and pull through. Let's go. We're going to go for the one on the top of the bonus points. And, 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 and we get it. Let's go. All right. Yeah, I, I don't have any idea what I'm saying, but, you know, it's getting crazy. And uh, so it's happening in there. We're getting crazy up in here. Oh. Let's go, man. He's out there. Look. Let's go. Something's wrong. Something's definitely wrong. Oh. Ah, oh, man. This is devastating, man. Let's just see what happens here at the Central Valley Vex Robotics, you know, tournament. And this is Air Indy 5000, and this is Sulu Row. That's right here on the left hand side. That was so sick. But uh, PJ right here. Uh, I think that was one of the best plays of all time. Yeah, uh, Kobe Bryant. I'm Ruben Gonzalez. I'm here at the Vex Robotics competition with uh, Jake Lee. So I see you have your robot right here. How long did it take you guys to build this? Uh, generally, uh, the basic about maybe a week. Uh, the, re the arm, another week. But uh, the, uh, actually the pickup system actually took about an hour, which was just the last hour. Um, who designed the robot? Who thought of, of this design? Um, it was originally me. Uh, we, well, me and my friend, uh, who's uh, currently actually in the hospital right now, unfortunately. Uh, we are both uh, contemplating different designs. Uh, unfortunately, he, he's been getting sick a lot lately, so um, I had to take up most of the design and also the uh, build, unfortunately. Uh, I wish he was here, though, so. Okay. Um, how was your guys' last competition or match? Uh, the last match, uh, surprisingly, I was trying to score, and then the uh, other robots uh, accidentally got under ours, and then uh, basically, we were, both, both of us were not moving. Uh, but my teammate was able to uh, pick up the points, and so, yeah. I see you have um, a sensor right here in the back. Can you explain what this does? Uh, as of right now, actually, it's not, it's not currently doing anything. Uh, but the purpose of this sensor, called a uh, quadrilateral uh, encoder, is to measure uh, degree uh, changes in uh, angle. And therefore, we can actually translate that into change in the position, uh, distance, length, and et cetera, so forth. And uh, this goes full 360 and uh, can, uh, even uh, past the past 360. And I was originally going to use this for um, uh, autonomous selection, so I can pick different autonomous modes. But because of the fact that this world was kind of built really uh, pretty quickly, uh, I didn't have time to build any uh, any advanced programs for it. I also see you have your pneumatic tank there. Why do you have it there? I don't see any tubing coming out of it. Uh, originally, it was supposed to have some sort. Uh, originally, it was supposed to have some sort of pneumatics, pistons going through it. Uh, that again, I didn't have time. Um, I was running out, running out of time. So uh, I had to take off the pistons and um, I had to start the uh, picking system from scratch. Okay, well I'm gonna leave you alone for now. Uh, goodbye. Thanks Thank for your time. So we're here at the Central Vol. I'll redo that. Redo that. Yeah. <laughs> we're.
We're here at the Central Valley High School of Extra Robotics Sack Attack Tournament. Uh, this is Cecilia Vexis Jr. My name is Carlos Rodriguez with uh, Air Indy. Yeah. So, uh, how do you feel about the tournament today? I'm, just, I'm supposed to be interviewing you, dude. How do you feel about the tournament? I just asked you that question. Well, no, I was, I'm supposed to be interviewing you. Have your own questions? I thought you were supposed to be a reporter. All right, so hold on. We're here at the Central Valley Robotics Tournament. What's your guys' names? AJ Dizon. Kyle Snow. Ganesh Farim. <laughs> Irvin Bakai. Avi Tube. Okay, what's your guys' team name? 9378T. Oh, that sounds wonderful. Otherwise known as Theta. Okay, so how do you guys feel about you guys? How do you feel about the tournament? Um, there's a lot of competition out there. Um, we're just gonna try our best, pretty much. Uh, how do you guys feel about the robot? Uh, nice. I'm excited. I think we're to do well. All right, that's cool. That's cool. How long did you guys approximately like take to just build the robot? Three days. Yeah, no. three days. Two weeks. Two weeks. <laughs> yeah, more like two weeks. Yeah. All right. Well, that's cool. And if we're have a good look at the tournament, and you know, yeah. good luck. Thank you. Amen. Yeah. 